Hey good morning friends, this is Abhishek from Games Dragon and in this video I'll be showing you the gameplay for Ride and as well as I'll resolve the issue of keyboard not detecting. First of all, run as administrator and this will load the first menu. This is where you select your language, video settings, configuration, graphics and others. So in video settings you can see I have my graphics card GTX 970 and I have set the resolution at 1080p and vsync I have disabled and anti-aliasing I have set it at 4x. Now in configuration of graphics I have set everything to max. Track texture I have put it at 4gb because my graphics card is 4gb and reflection quality high and all my details high. Audio settings I have not done anything and networking I have not done anything. So let me quickly start the game by clicking on play. Alright, now game is getting loaded. On top left hand side you can see the frame rate per second and other details of the graphics card. Alright, let's start with the milestone logo. And the bottom right hand side you can see there are few lines coming in that's actually the load sign that game is getting loaded. So you need to be patient when the load signs shows up. Okay, so now you can see the beautiful texture of this game. This is the person the who is driving the game. Is your identity in the world of okay, so now you can select your gender, male or female. The character of the game will change accordingly. So I'll select male and you can change your name, surname, everything in this game. So this will make game more interactive. You feel like you are actually playing this game. Oops, I have written this document late and write Abby. Okay. I'll select my country, that's India. Okay. Let's go right. Alright. Okay, so I'll leave the, these things and I'll just skip this and I'll move to bike selection. Choose a bike to start. Okay, so my favorite Ducati. Okay, I'll select this. And so when it's asking like do you want to do the training so I'll say no. Okay. Now I'll be telling you how you can resolve that issue like many many times what happens you will start the game and your keyboard will not work. So how to fix that so every time you switch on the game like start the game go to options and go to controls and do the manual changes like at least one button you need to change it every time uh, or whatever buttons you like I prefer accelerate as up so I change that and I come back to the game so that's the only fix as of now uh, now let me show you the quick mode here we have different option like changing the track and we have multiple tracks available here. I can ride on any track. So let me select Sierra and Fader. And you can go forward and backward direction on any of the tracks. So let me select one of the forward direction. And I'll start the game quickly. And the game is getting loaded. Yeah, this takes a bit more time than expected. And it loads twice. I don't know why. See, the first time it's getting loaded and again after getting this thing completed if i hit enter again it starts loading i don't know what is the issue behind this but it takes approximately 30 seconds now you can see the game is loaded and i have to click on race and now you can see the frame per second is running at 72 98 97 all right now the actual frame rate can be seen when I'm running the bike. Okay, it's running at 96, 70, 92. It's fluctuating. Okay, it's going at 9700. Frame rate is awesome. The game is very smooth. The game is very responsive. Controls are also really good. I can actually control. I can handle it very efficiently. I think there are there is some assistance provided, but I am able to play this game. This is the first time I'm playing this game and it's feeling so comfortable. Wow, graphics all around you can see this looks amazing. Gameplay is really small. Only problem is that the keyboard issue. I'm sure there will be some fix coming soon. So till that time 
can just do this start the game go to options change the keyboard settings and save it that's all and you have to play the game all right so this was my video to show you how you can resolve the keyboard problem and as well as the performance on graphics card that's GTX 970 I hope you like my video and if you like please subscribe and share my video have a nice day bye bye